Now I'm about a second from the hook, look, strap your rap book Before you get your wet style shook Can I get down? Hey, what's up? It's me, Jardy, and today I've got a hip-hop tutorial for you. Today we're going to be learning the Reebok, and also I'm going to be throwing in a bit of Cabbage Patch in there. All right, let's get started. First, we're going to start with the feet, okay? So we're going to start on the end count. On the end count, we're going to lift this leg right here. So we're going to go and one, and one, five, six, seven, eight, and one. Easy. All right, so next, on the end count after the one, we're gonna lift this back leg, and, okay? So we're gonna go and, one, and two. All right, five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two. And then let's just keep doing that until we get the rhythm, okay? Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five and six and seven and eight and one two and three and four and five six and seven and eight after that we're going to be turning around to the other side and here's how we're going to do that and one and two and three and four so here's how that goes and one and two and we're going to lift our leg again and, and then we're gonna go step down three, and then we're gonna step with this leg, and four. Now we're facing this way, okay? So it's gonna be and three and four, like that, okay? So from the top, let's try it. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four. After that, we're now facing this way. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side, except we're gonna start with this leg first. And five, and six, and seven, and eight. Five, six, seven, eight from the top, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, let's keep it going for a couple of eight counts. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, now that we have the leg work, we're gonna add the arms. So what we're gonna do is when we lift this leg on the end count, we're gonna put this arm back. We're gonna go and like that, okay? So it's gonna go like this along with the leg, all right, and one, okay? So the other arm is gonna go like this, and one, like that. So the other one is gonna go back and then go up when this one goes down, okay? So essentially you're just going like this. Five, six, seven, eight, and one. And then you're gonna go and two, and three, and four. Let's keep it going. And five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, and that is the first two counts of the arms. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn it around uh, along with the rest of our body when we face this way, okay? So how we do that is basically you just keep this, you just keep this movement going, all right? Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and, and then we're gonna go three and four, all right? So, and three and four, and then we're gonna go and, like that, okay? Let's try it again. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, 
and three and four and five. And then we do the same thing this way. Let's practice it for a little bit though. And five and six. Let's do it again. And five and six. And then let's keep going. And seven and eight. So let's just go smoothly through the movement without stopping too much. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. Now that we have the arms and the legs, now we're going to put the rest of the body uh, specifically for this one, the chest, okay? So here's how the chest is gonna go. Now the chest is what's uh, kind of like gonna be giving you the rhythm of this movement, right? A lot of the rhythm that comes from hip hop dance in general comes from your body and this one is no different. Our chest is gonna be going in and out during specific parts of this move and here's what I mean, okay? So we're gonna go and one on the end count, we're going to put out our chest, okay? We're gonna go put out our chest and like that. And two. So we're gonna go and, and one and two. And then on the end count after two, you're gonna put out your chest again. And three, okay? So let's just keep it going rhythmically so that you get like everything put together, all right? So your chest is gonna go out on the end counts. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, so the feeling you're gonna get when you go forward with that chest um, is when you go here, it's gonna feel like you're going up with the chest, like you're going up like that, okay? You're gonna go and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, okay? So let's try it again, five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. Now, we're gonna do it to get to the other side. And here we go, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna do it like this. And one, and two, and three, and four. Okay, so and three, and four. And then the other side, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five six and seven and eight. Now we're gonna do it, but we're gonna throw in the style, we're gonna throw in the finesse, gonna make it less choppy. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, three, four and five and six and seven and eight and one, two and three, four and five and six and seven and eight. That is the basic Reebok. I've got a few more variations for you. Here's the next one. For our first variation of the Reebok, it's gonna be pretty simple. We're not gonna leave the ground as high. So in the, pat, the first example, the basic one, you basically really lift off the ground. You can lift higher than that depending on, you know, like the music, how hype you are. But we're lifting off the ground. For the variation, we're not gonna lift and instead we're gonna be throwing in pivots. So our feet are gonna stay on the ground, okay? So it's gonna go like this. And see, I already didn't lift my foot. So we're gonna go on the ball or on the toe and one, and two, and three, and four. So it's gonna go, and one, and two, and 
3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 okay so all we're doing is we're pivoting on the balls of our feet we're lifting off the balls of our feet also okay and 1 and two and three and four and then we're gonna do it this way and five and six and seven and eight and one two and three four and five six and seven and eight and one two and three four and five six and seven and eight and one two and three four and five and six and seven and eight and all right and that is the first variation. Here is the second variation. We're going to exaggerate our neck movement and add in a neck roll. All right. So I'm not going to um, really go over the neck roll into too much detail today. So if you already know how to do this and the other way around, then good. Well, that's what we're going to add today. Uh, to the second variation. So now that you have the basic Reebok, we're going to add a neck roll while doing turning to the other side. Okay, so how we're going to do that is when we turn this way, our neck is going to roll that way or the same way. And then when we're here, when we go this way, our neck roll is going this way, okay? All right, so here's how it's gonna go. We're gonna go and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight. So one thing you might notice when it comes to the arms and the neck roll, when you do the neck roll, your arms are going to also kind of, the technique is going to change a little bit. And what happens is when you're doing the neck roll, it's sort of like when you do a chest roll and you do this sort of movement, that movement is added into this. So it's kind of a mixture of those two movements, all right? So if you already know how to do the chest roll, neck roll, and this arm movement, just add that. If not, don't worry, I'm gonna add that in a future tutorial regarding rolls, okay? So um, let's do it again, five, six, seven, eight and one and two and three four and five and six and seven eight and one two and three four and five and six and seven eight and all right so for our third and final variation we're going to add the cabbage patch into the reebok now if you don't know the cabbage patch don't worry i'm also teaching this in another tutorial so if you don't know it, just check it out. I'll put the link in the description. All right, so to start this off, instead of lifting your arm on the end count like this, like we've been doing, uh, we're gonna push out, all right? We're gonna use both our arms about chest height, and we're gonna push out like this, okay? Like that. So we're gonna go, and like that, and one, all right? Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and then on the end count, or on the one, you're gonna bring it in, and then on the end count, just bring it in a little more, okay? So you're gonna open up like this. So you're gonna go and one, and two, and one, and two, and one, two, and one, and two, and then keep going until you get it. After that, what we're gonna do, and one, and two, and, and then we're gonna go three and four. We're gonna do the arm circles of the cabbage patch while we're turning around. So we're gonna go and one, and two, and three, and four. On the four, we bring it back in. On the five, 
we push back out. And five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, let's try it again. Let's start off slow until we get more comfortable. Then we'll go faster. All right, here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, and that is the Reebok with the Cabbage Patch. Now, let's put all four of the variations we've learned so far together into one combination. So we're gonna start with the basic, and then we're gonna add the one that pivots, then we're gonna add the one with the neck roll, and then finally, we're gonna add the one with the Cabbage Patch, all right? All right, so let's start. Five, six, seven, eight basic, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, with pivots, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and neck roll, and one, two, and three, four, and five, six, and cabbage patch, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, eight. All right, let's do it one more time, a little bit faster. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight. All right, and that is the Reebok. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. I'll see you next time. Peace. Yeah.